let's see about trichomonas which is a flagellate the characteristic feature of trichomonas is that they lack the cyst stage so there's only trophozoid form seen in trichomonas the most important species of trichomonas is trichomonas vaginalis this is the most common parasite causing sexually transmitted disease and the disease is more common in females morphological forms it has only trophozoite form there is no cyst form trophozoite form the trophozoite is pear shaped or pyriform shaped it resides in vagina and urethra of women urethra seminal vesicle and prostate of men it has five flagella four anterior flagella and one lateral flagella this lateral flagella is called as recurrent flagellum which forms the undulating membrane and this undulating membrane is supported by costa this is the picture of trophozoite of trichomonas vaginalis here it has five flagellae There is a food vacuole. It consists of a single nucleus. There are sideriferic granules, and there is an axostyle. There are four pairs of flagella, and then one flagella which forms the undulating membrane, supported by the costa. And the trophozoite is pear-shaped. Life cycle. of trichomonas vaginalis both the infective and the diagnostic stage is the trophozoite stage as this is the only form seen the spread is from asymptomatic carrier to sexual route it enters other individuals where there is longitudinal binary fission of the trophozoites pathogenesis of trichomonas vaginalis predisposing factors are vaginal ph more than 4.5 hormonal levels in coexisting vaginal flora asymptomatic infections 25 to 50% are carriers next is acute infection it is vulvo vaginitis in acute infection of trichomonas vaginalis there is foul smelling purulent vaginal discharge and this discharge is frothy yellowish green with polymorphonuclear leukocytes and there is strawberry appearance of vagina called as colpitis macularis in case of chronic infection there is pruritus itching and pain during coitus and the vaginal discharge is scanty complications include pyosalpings pus in the fallopian tube endometritis inflammation of the endometrium infertility low birth weight and cervical erosions lab diagnosis of trichomonas vaginalis microscopy under wet saline mount trophozoites are demonstrated culture is the gold standard method for lab diagnosis antigen detection in vaginal secretion using elisa or immunochromatographic test antibody detection using elisa molecular method like pcr other methods of investigation include increase vaginal ph there is positive whiff test here the vaginal discharge is taken and 10% potassium hydroxide is added to it as there is increased vaginal ph this reacts with potassium hydroxide to form an amine which gives a fishy odor this is whiff test this is the 
image showing trichomonas vaginalis trophozoid under James Astin. Treatment of trichomonas vaginalis infection is by either metronidazole or tinidazole. This is all about trichomonas vaginalis. Thank you.